Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you hear any noise in the background, my neighbor is getting her housework done. So sorry if you hear, you know, noise in the background. I'm still trying to figure out what's going on with me uploading like from my computer to YouTube because it takes such a long time, like literally hours. And I've been filming from my phone because I want it to be, you know, uploaded instantly. I'm missing views and time because YouTube want to take forever to upload my video. So Sorry again if it's on my phone. I hope the quality is really good and I hope you guys can hear me well. And once again, sorry if you hear any background noise. So, recently I bought this book off of Amazon and I got it delivered last week. And I did a little playing around with it and I wanted to make a video about it. So, one of the things that I want to learn how to do is calligraphy. Um, just because it'll make my planner look cute and I also do want to have possibly a planner business or a stationary business in the future and it'll be you know good to know how to write all pretty like this so I got this book off Amazon it's probably like six to eight dollars and then of course you know shipping and stuff but it was like really really cheap um, this is paperback and this is just how it looks and I tried the online approach to, um, you know, print out paper and write and learn that way. But I felt like I just really needed a workbook. I know that probably sounds crazy, but it works for me. So I decided after extensive research, because, you know, I had to read reviews and things, um, I decided to give this one a try. So this is how it looks. This book pretty much has good reviews the only thing that i kept seeing uh was to be careful writing on the pages because they uh i guess bleed through the pages i haven't tried it yet so i wouldn't know i just decided to go ahead and just write on a separate page because i want this book to stay in really good condition so what i like about this book is that it starts by showing you um the basics, telling you what you need to have, showing you um, different types of calligraphy. And then it the thing that really caught my eye the most was uh, this page right here, which is the page that I'm on. I just kind of started, but I said I was going to take my time doing it, um, is the basic strokes. Apparently, one of the main things about calligraphy is learning uh, the basic strokes and learning how to use your pen and everything. So... They really caught my attention. Uh, like I said, I write on a separate sheet of paper because they say that, you know, the people that use this book, it bled through the pages, so I'm not sure, and I didn't want to risk it. But just to show you real quick, I did post on my social media, but I'll also show you on here. This is kind of what I've been working on. I'm going to redo it. I was just, like I said, playing around, trying to figure out what pen worked for me because I bought, like, I think three or four different pens. So, oh, guys, let me tell you, the type of pen marker, whatever you use, definitely matters. So if you look on here, I used a brush marker from the 99 cent store. That's how that look. And then I went ahead and because I felt like it wasn't going to be like effective the way I wanted to. And I wasn't going to learn the way I wanted to. I decided to go ahead and buy an actual like brush pen set so this is the 99 cent one this is how it look i think it's good for like kids and beginners and i think that's probably what it's for and then um all of these black lines are from this brand i think it's pronounced tumbao or tumbo sorry if i get it wrong i'm new to this but um yeah i got a little set and i got it on sale obviously i used a coupon because apparently they stuff costs a little bit of money but you get what you pay for i'm learning that now with this calligraphy um so it comes with like two markers a brush pen a pencil and eraser and i'm probably not going to use all of that i may or may not but these lines right here that's what i've been using with this one this is the brush pen And I'll show you the tip too. It's a flexible tip. And um, 
it bends really good and not to the point where I feel like I'm gonna break it. So I do like that. And I've learned it's easier to have a flexible tip marker to do the calligraphy. So I just thought I'll show you guys that. Back to this book. I haven't been past the first few pages, but I still wanna show you guys how the book look. I, like I know it shows you uh, different lettering patterns and I think it shows you how to connect them and everything. So I'm gonna just quickly like flip through parts of the book. I'm not gonna do the whole book because I wanna get more time with it and be able to do like a full review on it. But so far, like I really, really like it. And what I like is that it shows you different types of like calligraphy letters and how to embellish them and make them look good. Ooh, they got words too. Like I said, guys, I'm just flipping really fast through this book. And let me, uh, I think there was one more part I wanted to show you guys. Oh, I like how throughout the book, it shows like different instructions and stuff that I can actually like sit down and read, especially in the beginning of the book. Like I, I sat down and I read it a couple of times just to make sure like I really got it. Like it really goes into detail. And it even tells you parts of the letter. So I think this look like it's going to be a good, you know, beginner's book. So I can't wait to continue practicing and giving it a try. And I'm even thinking about documenting like a calligraphy journey just to like show how better I get over time. I'm still debating on that. But if you think I should and you're interested in that, definitely leave a comment and let me know. I think it'll be like really cool to know that people will be interested in seeing that first of all. But anyways, before I get off this video, I wanted to show you this book. Also, I want to show you something else. So before I got this book, I had got this book. So apparently, now I know, when I say calligraphy, I've learned that there's a lot of different calligraphies. So this one is like the original calligraphy, and this one is the modern calligraphy. And I wanted to learn the cute, curvy, modern calligraphy. But I still went ahead and got this anyway because I'm like, that's more fonts to learn. It'll be cool to learn it. Um, this book, honestly, is definitely harder to grasp. And it's, I, I don't know how to explain it. I just didn't really like it. But I think maybe once I get better with the calligraphy I'm trying to do, maybe it'll come together. So um, I'm going to work with this one too. But I definitely tried it and it was a struggle. Um, it also came in this pack. I got it from Joann's and it came in this pack. And I'm going to open it so you can see. So this part is the ink and this part is like the fountain pens that you use. And that was the hard part, I think, was trying to use a fountain pen to do it. So... I have this pen right here. This is how it looks. So I just wanted to show you guys that. And then I was using this book to practice when I first got it. So I want to thank you guys. Uh, I'm also learning how to do like kawaii drawings. And this is the book that I'm learning from. So. I'm trying to learn to do a lot of different stuff. Um, also Spanish. I know I'm trying to learn a lot of stuff here. So this is a page I was trying to like learn how to write with the fountain pen and stuff, but I just wasn't feeling it. So that's why I decided to look elsewhere. Like I said, I might come back to the book, but I'm not sure. So I just wanted to show you guys all of this just in case someone doesn't know and you know like myself and end up getting like the wrong thing so apparently i'm trying to learn modern calligraphy but i mean calligraphy is still you know the right term it's just a little more broad so but got this from amazon a few dollars i'll link it in the description box so you guys can take a look and definitely if you're really interested in getting it i say go for it it looks like a really good beginner book but I will probably do a more in-depth updated review once I play with it a little more. But I just really wanted to show you guys. 
Um, please like and subscribe for more content. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for keeping up my planner journey. If you're new here, hey, how you doing? Welcome. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Take care, guys.